remember being yeah. six years old and dreaming about winning the Olympics in swimming, and then as soon as I switched to judo, I immediately started dreaming about winning the Olympics in judo, and as soon as I switched to MMA, I dreamed about being a world champion. Before I could even talk, my dad convinced me I was going to be the best in the world. It, it's an idea that is given, it's a principle that was ingrained. These girls already had lives when they decided to give being the best in the world a shot. My life was always being the best in the world. And there's no playing catch up with that shit. Make sure I'm not eating too much this last week. I don't really pay too much attention about what I eat before because I need the energy to train, but coming down to the wire, gotta gotta worry about every every little pound of stuff. I love Albuquerque. <laughs> I don't think he's ever really want to move, but Albuquerque is really good. They're a very supportive town of any kind of fighting, so a very, very big amount of support and respect from everybody in Albuquerque. It's awesome. Bye. Okay. Love you. Right. Love you. Thank you. Well, see you later. Thank you. Well, you. Thank 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 Definitely different than what I'm used to. Driving 45 minutes from the airport, that would get you all the way across town and out. Mile to cool down, I guess. <laughs> All done. Uh, she's undefeated. She's 9 and 0, and she's finished every single one of her fights except for like her first fight ever was a decision. And there's been a lot of times too where she was falling behind in a fight, and every single time that ever happened, she's come back and finished the other girl, and so she's a uh, quite indomitable spirit and a very dangerous opponent. All right, thank you. Till next time, <laughs> bye. Bruce Slimer. Slimer? Slimer. Slimer room. It's where they film Ghostbusters? Right? Uh, the scene, the Slimer scene. That one scene, yeah. Slimer scene that goes through the party and goes nuts or something like that. Yeah. It was this hotel? That's cool. Yeah, for a cloak size. Uh, extra small, like the straw weight ones. Straw weights? Uh, the smallest hands in the whole company. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Look, like my whole hand oh, yeah, fits yeah, yeah. in three fingers. Look how little my hands are. Yeah, over there. Perfect. Mm, that's a good one. You're good? Uh, thank yeah. you guys. For sure. your time. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, thank you guys. Appreciate it. <sighs> I think I saw you in a preview. Fast and Furious the other day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you turn out to be bad or are you good? <laughs> you can try and watch and figure yeah, that out. <laughs> Let's see around to look right at the camera for me. Uh, what kind of crowd do you expect here in LA? I mean, you're going to have fans, friends, family in the audience. The, the only person in the, in the crowd that I ever think about is my mother. And I will never allow anyone to hurt me in front of my mother, ever. Cool. All right. I think that we're good. Cool. That is it. So many women have walked in here trying to beat Rhonda and have failed. I'm different. In my mind, she's the second toughest fighter in the world. My goal is to break Rhonda, you know, to make her want to quit. I want to go out and implement my will. Hi, how are you? Good morning. Good. Cat. Pleasure. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Two undefeated fighters going at each other. Both have a ton of heart. 
both have a ton of experience. I expect the fight between me and Rhonda to be very intense, uh, very action-packed. All right, so we're going to have you closer to the front. I am the person to take the belt because I'm different. You know, I don't quit. I won't break. I'm resilient. I'm strong. I'm mentally tough. And uh, physically, I have everything that it takes to go out there and do it. There's nothing anyone can do to stop me. Now, Rhonda doesn't intimidate me. Nothing intimidates me. And just with your hair on your left side, just kind of... On a personal level, this belt to me means a lot of accomplishment. So this belt and what it accomplishes for me is something that is unnameable. It's, it's bigger than I can describe. I we have to just get the updated stuff, but... The colors are cool. Looking strong, yeah. Really, it just comes down to getting in there and doing it. I have everything that it takes to go out there and win that belt. I'm not afraid, I'm excited and anxious to get in there. It's gonna come down to who's the better fighter that night.